Right, if everything could go right in this video, that would be absolutely amazing. Um, I've already spilt my drink. I've already dropped my camera on the floor. And yeah, it's been a good week. So let's... About to leave already packing come with me I'm not really Hello everybody welcome back to another YouTube video I am so happy because it's basically five o'clock here in the UK and it's still light outside I remember like two weeks ago it was still at five o'clock getting really really dark but spring is on the way because it's still light and hopefully it won't get uh, won't get dark now till about 6 p.m um but we've got a bit of sunshine and it's just making me feel good and this lighting is so much better i'm filming it in my bedroom because a lot of you guys said that you really liked this background in my room so i'm going to keep this background um i really liked my background with all my handbags but i feel like it's just very chaotic and it needs a tidy up and i've also got something in my eye which is very annoying. I've tried to film at least five times today, but I spilt my drink and then my camera like fell over and I knocked it with my foot and I basically just gave up. I was like, no, I'm done. I was texting my friend Shannon um, because we literally are in the same mood at the moment. Um, and we've both just been saying how we've been feeling really crap and we're just in a bit of a funk and we can't get out of it and literally everything that could go wrong was going wrong today so this is the last time i'm going to film this video and if it doesn't work out then you know what whatever you're going to get this sort of content because i literally i've given up i was done i'm like nah i'm done see you later but anyway i I'm back with another video and this is going to be my what's in my Uniqlo video uh, what's in my Uniqlo video see literally it's already going wrong what's in my Uniqlo bag so I'm gonna take a step back I'm gonna chill out namaste I'm just gonna have a drink here we are let's start again yeah I literally filmed this morning um, and I dropped my glass all over the floor so yeah, literally juice went everywhere. Bit of a sticky mess. So anyway, this is like round three. So a what's in my Uniqlo bag. And this bag was gifted from my friend Shannon. And I'm so grateful because I've literally been using this bag every single day. It's so versatile. It's so functional. And I just love the look of it. It's just very casual. I can literally chuck it on when I'm going to the shops when I am sorry and now my phone is completely shouting at me. Um, so yeah, I can literally just chuck this on and take it with me everywhere I go and I've been using it non-stop the past week. And not only that, I love the colour, excuse me, it's in this gorgeous like taup colour, I think that's how you say it, um, but yeah, I just really, really love it. It's very neutral, it goes with literally everything. Um, and yeah, I love it. So I'm just going to jump straight in. And another good thing about this bag is not only is it functional, not only is it versatile, not only is the colour just really plain that it could just go with everything. It is very inexpensive. Um, we do have a Uniqlo in London, um, but I'm not sure if there is anywhere I live because I live sort of like down south. Um, so it's like a couple of hours away from London. Um, so I don't get all the good shops that London have. Um, but yeah, I know they've got a Uniqlo in London. I'm not sure if they've got one down south. But anyway, it literally fits a ton. Like I have, st I have too much stuff in here to be honest. Like there is way too much stuff. So I'm just gonna dive right in and basically show you one by one what I keep in my Uniqlo bag, which I absolutely love. So I have my Parada sunglasses. I know I'm really terrible. I have just thrown them in. However, I have been wearing these, so they don't really tend to stay in my bag because I do wear them more than anything, or I just pop them in my car um, in the cup holder, so they pretty much just stay there. But yeah, these are my Parada Sunnies, and I got these for my birthday, and I absolutely love them. So that's my Parada Sunnies. Then I've got my Louis Vuitton six key holder in the monogram print with my mini key, and a lot of people ask me about... Um, my fob 
so um, I say my fob but like the key ring that my key is attached to so this does come off um, I'm not going to do it but yeah I'll see where they are so you've got like the key to actually get inside it but my key is a um, stop start engine and um, you don't actually need like as long as you're near the car you can get into the car by just clicking the unlock button obviously um, but yeah, this is just a JCW fob because my Mini is a JCW, so it's got a little bit of extra power, but to be honest, um, I don't really use it. My boyfriend pretty much uses it more often than me. Um, but yeah, so that's just my Mini fob, and I love that. I got it from a Mini dealership. Um, if you know me, then you know that I am Mini obsessed, so I definitely want to do like another car tour video but more of like an amazon organization car tour because i see them a lot on youtube and i really love watching them they're like the tiktok style like asmr what's in my car how i organize my car videos and i'm obsessed with watching them so i think i'm going to do that because i do have a lot of stuff in my car for organization purposes so i think i'm going to film that and buy like a whole um, back box of just amazon car stuff and then film a video if you want to see that then leave a comment down below and obviously subscribe to my channel um so yeah really love this use it every single day and not only that if you're just running out for an errand you can literally pop your card at the back and then just take this that's literally all you need is like this your card and that's it so love that then i've got this gorgeous tortoise shell comb and this was also gifted from my friend shannon I love this, um, I'm, when I'm at work I use this quite a lot because um, obviously I have to have my hair up so I just sort of put it up in the morning and it tidies it up a bit. Then I've got my perfume atomizer and this is from Dior and this is just the handbag size, absolutely love this, not sure if my camera will focus but I love the packaging and I just think it's gorgeous, I think I'm going to spray some now because you can never go wrong with perfume. Then I've got my purse, and this is from a brand called Bieber, or Biber, I'm not sure. Um, I've had this for ages and I don't actually like it. I am on the hunt for a new vintage Louis Vuitton zippy purse in the monogram print, um, but I'm just waiting for payday so I can actually buy one because I made a lot of money on Vinted and they ended up just buying a load of like other stuff. So I've bought myself a YSL necklace which I can't wait to arrive and I just got some bits for my capture wardrobe so I'm waiting for pay waiting for payday then I can buy myself a new purse. But I do like the croc print of this and I love the gold hardware and I do love the fact that it's got zips because I can fit all my cards on one side and then literally all the coins on the other. So yeah but I do really want to get myself the Louis Vuitton zippy purse which is similar to this. Um, so yeah, really, really loving that. I did sell my Chanel Boy purse that I had and I sold it to a really lovely girl who actually watches my videos now. Um, so I think her name was Saida. Um, so if you're watching, hello. Um, I think that's just really amazing. She's such a lovely girl and she actually works in a hospital in London as well. So that was really, really cool that, um, yeah, obviously I work in a hospital, so we kind of related with that. So yeah, that was really cool. Such a small world, I feel like. Um, and then the last thing I have is this little pouch from Cloth and Paper. And this was also gifted from Shannon. So yeah, as you can see, Shannon spoils me. Um, and I really, really love this little pouch from Cloth and Paper. I use it for all of like my small handbag items, just so they're not like floating around in the bag. Um, they're all organized in this little pouch. So I'm just gonna take out one by one what I have. So I've got my Rituals lip balm and I love how it pops out like literally there's a bit of ASMR for you but I just I love it and it's so moisturizing and I, yeah this is just literally my favorite I also have the Lano lips one which is like the Australian equivalent we do have Lano lips here in the UK as well um but my friend Shannon gifted me the Lano lips one and I love it it's just the same as this to be honest so I've been like mixing the two then I've got my hand sanitizer, and this is just a Bath and Body Works one. Love this. Um, I think Bath and Body Works hand sanitizers are like 78% or 80% like alcohol, which obviously isn't like 99%, but anyway, um, I love the smell of them. Then I've got a MAC lipstick, and I love this lipstick. This is the Lorna Lux lipstick. I'll put some on because I'm not actually wearing any lipstick today um so yeah really really like this it's just like a very neutral color and it's almost like your lips but better 
Um, so yeah, I really, really love that. And if I didn't mention, it's the Lorna Lux collection. I bought like a pouch um, and she did her own little collection, which I love. So I've got that. Then I've just got some Kleenex tissues or Kleenex tissues. You can't go wrong with tissues, especially me, because I suffer really badly with allergies all seasons, all year round. Um, so I'm always needing tissue. And then I've got some hand wipes. These are just from Primark and these are really inexpensive, about 60p. You can pick these up. Um, they've got like different like patterns on the packet, which I thought was really cute. So I need to go and pick myself up some more of those. Then I've got my Chanel hand cream and this just looks like a little egg. Absolutely love this hand cream. Don't get me wrong, it's not the best formula and I do think it is quite expensive for what it is but obviously you're paying for the brand and Chanel I love Chanel it's gorgeous so and not only that it smells really really nice so you can't go wrong with a good hand cream especially the Chanel one so that's that then I've got my paracetamol um, because I'm always suffering with headaches so I always need some paracetamol with me and the last thing that I have is my airpods and these are just the um, old AirPods, not the newer ones, obviously, because the newer ones are a bit smaller, but these work really well, and I absolutely love my AirPods. Literally, when I'm at work on my break, I pop them on and watch some YouTube videos, um, when I'm listening to music in the evenings, or watching, like, um, a YouTube video and editing, I like to put these on. I've got my big headphones, which I also love, but, um, obviously I use them mostly for, like, when I'm at the gym and stuff. So, yeah, really love this. I do want to buy a new case and I really like the leather look ones like the black leather look ones I feel, feel like they look really classic and they will go with all of my bags um so yeah I'm thinking of getting a new case um just because I don't really like this one to be honest I only picked it up because it was really cheap and obviously just protecting my airpods so yeah that is pretty much everything that I have in my Uniqlo bag so what I'm going to do now is fill the bag back up and then do a couple of little shots with the bag on um, just so you can see how it sits on me um, I am I think I'm about 5'4 um, I'm not like the tallest I'm pretty much an average height for a female um, obviously I'm not going to tell you my weight but I wouldn't say I'm like small but I'm not like big I'm just sort of like in between um, I'm a bit chunky around the edges and my thighs but I feel like this just sits really well no matter what body shape you are to be honest this is just really really flattering and yeah I just really love this so I'm gonna do a couple of little mod shots with it on and that's pretty much it so I'm probably gonna conclude this video here and obviously if you did really enjoy this video then definitely subscribe to my channel because I've got so many more videos to come. I want to do some more capsule wardrobe videos. I've got some more planner videos to come because I have basically got some new dashboards in my GM agenda and I've got some new accessories I really want to show you from cloth and paper. If you haven't heard of cloth and paper then get to know because they're like the best insert stationery brand in the world in my opinion. I love them. So yeah I want to do some more planner videos and then I want to do some more traveling videos. Me and my boyfriend are going to Italy. We're doing a driving holiday in May, which is literally like just over a month away and I cannot wait. It's going to be amazing. It's gonna be really romantic. And we haven't had like a week away together in such a long time. So I'm really excited for that. And yeah, I just can't wait for Italy. We're literally gonna drive to um, the Euro Tunnel and then from the Euro Tunnel to France, from France to then Italy. We wanna do a day trip in Monaco and then we wanna do another day trip in Switzerland. Um, Switzerland's about four hours away, I believe, from Italy, Lake Como, and then um, Monaco's about two hours. So we're just gonna do like day trips here and there and then obviously explore around Lake Como and Bellagio. So I just, I really can't wait for that holiday, honestly. Like, and we're going in my mini as well because I love taking my mini to like road trips. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's everything I have to, you know, say at the moment. Um, so I'm gonna go before I waffle on anymore and I hope you guys have an amazing week. If you haven't watched any of my other videos, I'll link some below so you can catch up. If you're new here, which I would love, so yeah. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action.
direction What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out